If you're feeling pain somewhere in your body, if you're feeling disoriented, lost, confused, not really knowing what you're supposed to do, well, congratulations! One, this video is for you. Two, you're about to discover something really beautiful about yourself. So, without further ado, let's dive into this. Like, subscribe, and share. Hi, my name is Lotfi Merat. Today I'm going to talk about all the physical discomfort you're experiencing. Maybe even emotional, mental discomfort, instability, unease. I'm talking about now. The year is 2024. So what's going on? Well, the world is changing. Frequency is rising. Meaning, we need to adapt. We need to upgrade. We need to clean our shit. Every problem you're experiencing now is there to show you that there is something you need to change, something you need to let go, which is also a change. It can be that you have to let go of that job you're in, or that relationship you're in, or that friendship, or that project that you've been dreaming about or trying to get off the ground but it's not working. Can be anything. This is a time of opportunity. The opportunity to discover who you truly are, what you really came to do here. If, for example, you came to bring justice, then you will have been experiencing a lot of injustice in your life, especially at a young age. If you came to bring love, to spread love, to just give love, then you may have experienced the lack of it or the loss of it also often at a young age. It's not for nothing that a lot of people who have had bad experiences in their youth are doing at an adult age things that are very related to that. If they have been abused as a child, they're often helping to prevent child abuse or helping children to deal with abuse or helping adults to deal with their child abuse. I'm a perfect example of that too. So there are several things that I experienced in my youth and they all got reflected in my work. Fighting for justice, helping people with sexual abuse and getting back their sexuality, gaining not just back the sexuality, but actually a balanced sexuality. Or learning to enjoy the sexuality, enjoy lovemaking, maybe for the first time in their lives ever, through healing the wound and discovering who they truly are and discovering what their needs are, what their true desires are. And I'm not talking about Hardcore sex and pornography and all that kind of crap. That is addictive stuff. It's like getting wasted, drinking till you're completely wasted, just not to feel your emotions. I'm thinking that it's fun. Basically, that is running away from whatever you need to deal with. But that's a topic for another video. So take this opportunity because things are changing anyway. The world is not going to stop for you. Things are happening. So those who work on themselves now will benefit from all the changes. Those who refuse will have much more work to do later in a shorter period of time which is just like, hey, you have this deadline coming and the longer you wait, the worse the situation gets. Or 
they get fired and they really fuck up at the end, which could mean literally your death. If that's what you want, totally fine. Just don't complain. If you do not know how to do this, or if it's too difficult for you, or you get stuck in it, you tried already. You tried meditating, you started working on yourself, started working on your inner peace, on grounding, on relaxation, calming your mind. Something is not working out, then contact me. Or contact somebody else, I don't care. But find help. These are successful people in the world who ask for help. Who go to people who are better than them at the things they're not good at. So they get things done. I have a variety of tools at my disposal to use to help you figure out what's going on, what is keeping you from moving forward, what's holding you back, what, what blockages you have, if there was a trauma, whatever happened in your life, whatever is happening now and to try to make sense out of it. Making sense out of it can help you move forward. So contact me. Do something. Have a wonderful day. Like, subscribe and share.